Hello there guys, today we will be doing a video of my 52 inch as you can see, Laguna ceiling fan, I got the ceiling fan from Thomas Aaron, Baroque at Fanimation Group Trip for $10, this ceiling fan is actually complete, believe it or not, they made a few variants of these, the, they obviously made the 52 inch brown and brass ones, and they also made the white and brass ones, and then the they made the replicas of these, but they were obviously the 36 inch version with the different brackets, and this is before they had the speed control. Well, after they removed it. The bomb canopy is a plastic brown canopy, and the top canopy is actually a Fasco canopy. So I have it on an Emerson wall control. This um, control went to my Emerson premium. Obviously, the flywheel's being fixed. It's right here. So, yeah. Anyways, I guess we will get to low. All right, so here is low. And the capacitor's um, going out a little bit. So that's what Thomas Aaron told me, and he said I'm probably gonna have to replace it soon. And um, what well, I have it on, so I have it running on medium speed on the control because um, it stalls out on low. Because watch, I'll put it on low, and it just stalls out. Just stalls out. So I have to put it on medium, and then I'll just adjust the control. It is a little noisy though. But this is the best low speed I can give you guys for now. I don't know too much about these fans, but what I do know is that SMC was a manufacturer for Hampton Bay as well. And they did a lot of varieties of ceiling fans for Hampton Bays. For example, the SMC Littletons, the SMC Landmarks, the SMC um, Huntingtons. There's just a lot of them. But, anyways, I guess we'll get to medium. I'm pretty sure that these were only sold in brown and brass. The 52 inch ones, but the 36 inch ones were sold in brown and brass and white and brass. To be honest, I don't know where the Lagunas were sold, so that's one thing I don't know. I like the um, 52 inch ones way better than all of them because they have a very ornate design. And I just like them a lot better. This will move to high speed now. Here's high. And I do need to replace the cap. Wait, well, that's a five. Well, that just slows it down. I feel like high speed is slower than um, medium, so the capacitor probably has to be replaced, so it's going to be replaced pretty soon, and I did oil the bearing for this video because they were very stiff, so it does wobble a little bit, but it's fine. going real slow now, I don't know why. It's definitely a capacitor issue, but don't worry, the cap will be replaced soon. Anyways, I guess we can get to spin that around. Here's off. I just have it hooked up to the wall control because 
even Thomas Aaron had to do this, like I said. The reason behind that is, is because the cap is failing pretty bad that to the point where it won't work very good on the speed control on the side of the housing. Um, so I have to, have to run on the three speed wall control made by Emerson. And I like the pointed tips on the blades because they're way cooler than the ones on the 3600 Lagunas. But anyways, thank you for watching. See you guys later. Goodbye.